in a galaxy far far away <laughs> in 2017 me and adam filmed some tutorials like that are like non-product biased so we thought we'd show you what we got up to hi everybody i'm kirsten meekin and welcome to my channel in this video i'm going to show you how to fill extremely long ass nails i mean like this one First of all, we need to push the toothbrush back. I need to turn the fan off before Adam shouts at me. Right, so I'm going to show you two different ways. Well, it's the same application, well, sim similar application, two different nails. So this nail is full of glitter, beautiful glitter. And then this nail is an ombre. Ombre! It's not even a thing. It I know. Hasn't. I've made it a thing. Hello. <laughs> <laughs> what did he say? Ole. Ole. Oh. Ole. Ombre. Ombre. No, ombre. Ombre means man. Ombre. Ole means ole. Well, ombre. Ombre. <laughs> there you go. See. See, it is a thing. So we've got an ombre and a glitter nail. I'm going to fill them. I'm going to show you how to fill both of them. I'm going to do them one at a time. First of all, I am going to whiz around this cute colour area with my super fine diamond bit. Okay, quite slow. And we're just going to run round from sort of 2 o'clock to 10 o'clock. And I'm just removing any non-living tissue. Now you know when it's living because it will bleed. Fail scream. So it's not going too fast. You shouldn't get too much friction. It's not going to eat away at the natural nail. It's just going to remove any of that non-living tissue. Same on this nail, it's exactly the same prep. Product application is slightly different. But the prep is exactly the same. And then what I'm going to do is I'm going to hand file some of this acrylic down, just touching the acrylic at the minute. I'm going to take off the top coat by filing that. Dust that away. I'm going to dehydrate the nail and I'm going to prime the nail. We're just priming the natural nail, we're not priming the acrylic. I'm going to be using Nail Nails powders today. So we've got acrylic clear and we've also got some acrylic that is called metallic pink. So we need a thin layer of clear because I find the metallic pink is super super pigmented you run the risk of it lifting off the nail so I always like to put a very thin layer of clear down and then we're going to go in with the metallic pink now this is here just for colour not for strength so you don't need to like put your apex in with the colour We'll rebuild and balance the apex with the clear.
opaque, it got nice and thin. So you can see here we need more height here for the opex. Now we're going to get a bead of clear and we're kind of sandwiching that colour between the thin layer of clear that we put down first and this next layer of clear. And this will also build your apex as well. I'm going to let that set and I'm going to move on to the glitter nail. The glitter tastic nail. So obviously we need to blend this in. Now I can't see any visible lifting, which is great. I'm going to use the file and just blend that into the natural nail. Remove any of the top coat of the full length of the nail. softer file to just blend that a little bit more and I know that I'm touching the natural nail that's why I'm using softer file. We're going to dehydrate, dehydrate and then prime and then we're using clear from nail nails and also intense pink and then we have two glitters here we have Sugar Plum Sparkle, Chunky Glitter, and Tickle Me Spink, Tickle Me Spink. Tickle Me Spink. What's a spink? I don't know, it's like a span. What pink? It's like Tickle on Spank. Oh dear. <laughs> tickle Me Pink, Chunky Glitter. Right, so first of all, I'm going to get some intense pink. I'm going to put that down. Make it nice and thin around the cuticle area, just glide it up. Then we're going to touch into the pink glitter. I don't want to say the name again because I'll just get it wrong. Now we're going to touch into the purple glitter. Now we only need a touch of this purple glitter because we just want a few of those particles on there just to add another dimension to the colour. Then I'm going to get intense pink, thin layer over that. And what the intense pink is just adding a little bit more of a blush pink at the back of the nail and then we're going to cap in clear so I'm building that apex up with the clear now because these nails are really long nails it's very important to get that apex right that is what's going to give the nail the strength the longer the nail the bigger the apex needs to be to support it I'm going to let that one dry now. So let's go back to the ombre nail. We're going to file this in now. So I'm making sure everything's nice and straight at the side. When you're doing a fill, you'll find that the nails will drop. So you need to rebalance those up and get those sides nice and straight. And then we're going to file the top surface once we've done that cuticle area. You want to blend everything down into the original length of the nail. So you've rebalanced the shape and the apex and you put the strength back into that nail. And then with a the buffer, I'm going to buff over this now to remove... Just like that. <laughs> I'm going to buff over to remove the demarcations and the nails. So all those scratches, we're going to reduce those down now. Smoothing that nail. I'm just cleaning over this nail now with some isopropanol alcohol just to remove any excess dust and then that is ready for top coating and the top coat I'm going to use today is diamond top coat from well gel now this is completely solvent free
pop that into the lamp. So we're going to file the glitter one now. So I'm going to do the same with this one. So I'm going to make sure those side walls are perfectly straight. So they'll come all the way to the point of the nail. Then I'm going to file around the cuticle. We're going to file around the cuticle. Well, she'll be coming around the cuticle when she comes. She'll be coming round the cuticle when she comes. <laughs> She'll be coming round the cuticle. Coming round the cuticle. Hot dogs for life. Coming round the cuticle when she comes. Yeah! She'll be piling over the top when she comes. Yes, she will. She'll, She'll be piling over the top when she comes. Yes, she will. She'll be piling over the top till the smooth as a baby's butt. But she'll be smiling <laughs> till she comes. <laughs> and there you are, that's just, just like that. Cruelty. It's cruelty, isn't it? Cruelty. I proper disapprove of spelling mistakes, so it's like one of So that's that one completely finished, top coated everything. What I'm going to do with both of them now is just put a little bit of cuticle oil on just to finish those gorgeous long nails off. Please ignore this poolie nail. It will not be poolie in the next hour. They are completely rebalanced, filled. Oh my god, they just look like the day they were born. <laughs> there you are, guys. I hope you've enjoyed the video. Don't forget to check us out on all the social media platforms. And I need you to subscribe to this channel and press the bell if you want notifications of when we're releasing new videos, which we will do quite frequently. Okay, guys, I will see you soon. Hi everybody, it's Kirsty Meekin and I am here on my fabulous channel. <laughs> <laughs>